It's a Mayhem Minute for uh, March 12th, 2015. I'm Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter. At Mayhem Show on the Twitter is WrestlingMayhemShow.com. Check out all of this stuff. And our friends at PittsburghWrestling.com, of course. And check out the new release, Cage Combat Fury in 8. Com- Cage Combat Fury in Clearfield 8. Um, for on DVD and digital download and so much more. Uh, so today I want to talk a little bit about NXT. Saw a couple stories uh, in my news feed. Uh, you know, one talking about uh, uh, some controversy that Triple H wants uh, Kevin Owens just to fight, just to wrestle his style when Bill DeMott was unhappy. Uh, this is all rumors and speculations. I, I know, you know, in the news and also other things about uh, how NXT they're looking at a Ring of Honor talent and to come into NXT and how NXT is really kind of looking as its own brand and not just developmental to bring the to the main roster. And I wanted to touch on that topic here uh, briefly at least um because i think that's really significant that that it has uh kind of come into its own to that point and i think there's there's a lot of uh talent that you're gonna find that is really gonna thrive in comparison i i i worry so much about them bringing somebody like a finn Balor, like a like, like a uh a hideo um, you know, up to the main roster, and what are we gonna do there, right? Alex Riley even kind of getting new life there, um, you know, against Kevin Owens, um, and it becomes this interesting developmental thing. It's 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 interesting, and I, and I think you're gonna see. I wonder how a Kevin Owens, I wonder how a Sami Zayn, any of these guys are going to last on the on the main roster when they're up against you know six foot four plus John Cena's and 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 these more built guys, the guys that we normally um, would notice in the main roster. I mean, Adrian Neville is a small guy, and maybe this is going to be the Ring of Honor little guys world that we end up with um, when we're you know, doing NXT and becomes its own brand. Plus we had, as we're seeing, uh, they, they taped um, NXT at the Arnold classic. That's going to be uh, its first on the road show. Plus they did a house show in Cleveland while they were at it in the area. Um, I think, I think this is going to be like we saw ECW back in the day, the WWE ECW. Let's make that clear um, that it becomes that alternative brand. Um, yeah, you're going to see stars as they see opportunities um, come up into the main roster, I think. But I wonder, you know, I, I would love to see eventually. And I think it's going to happen. I think it may happen as soon as this year. I think you may see, and I we're kind of predicting this in our Mayhem Mania over on the Wrestling Mayhem show, but we're filling that out with NXT stars because we don't see them as any different as fans. We don't see them as any different as the main roster because we're enjoying the show more. These two guys are talented. These are not developmental in the in the fashion of like, oh, he'll get better, you know, oh, we're seeing him develop. Um, I think... I think it's going to be very interesting, um, you know, that this does become its own brand, you know, uh, you know, me on the WWE Network exclusively for the most part, but maybe not, you know, maybe not completely exclusively. Um, really good pickup for, really good pickup for the network because uh, NXT, for those who don't know, NXT, the show, it's actually available on some other outlets like Hulu. I think it may still be um, um, shown locally on the Bright House uh, cable network down there, um, and of course internationally as well. But you still need the network to watch those takeover shows um, that are basically their pay per views, which you have to pay for the network, so it's a pay per view. Um, and uh, Triple H being apparently uh, happy with the social media buzz that it's it's doing. This is for the hardcore, and they're, this is WWE actually doing something for. Th- Fans that do a podcast in their basement, for instance, uh, are raving over something like this. Uh, so what do you think? Should NXT just be its own brand, just be its own thing, have its own stars? Will Will uh, Kevin Owens be the John Cena of NXT? Well, that's a very weird comparison, isn't it? Let us know here on comments to this video or social media on at Mayhem Show on the Twitters or our posts on Facebook and Google Plus for the Wrestling Mayhem Show. And check out everything else at WrestlingMayhemShow.com. We'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at SorgatronMedia.com.